Oh my gosh, there's a lot of walkers here. There's, oh shoot, okay, we gotta take him out. Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Alexon and welcome back everybody to the Crafting Dead server series. This is Somerset number 2 and if you guys want me to try a different server, let me know in the comment sections because I know that a lot of you guys may be kind of getting bored of Somerset because I am doing the solo version on Somerset number 2 and the version with Brazilla and I on Somerset number 1. So it could be very repetitive in a way. So let me know. I'd be more than happy to switch over to Atlanta for my solo series or Charlin or Covina. Let me know in the comment sections. But without further ado, Let's get started because the crafting dead has been something you guys have been craving for such a while now And I really do apologize I'm gonna be working really hard on bringing back the uh, crafting dead on my channel more often now because you guys love it so much but Yeah in the last episode I asked you guys if you guys had any challenges and uh, I mentioned that in the comment sections We're gonna start adding these challenges and I'd be picking from a few and I'd be doing it in the episodes So today we're gonna mention a few challenges now one thing I want to mention is the fact that today We're not going to clear up our inventory inventory because as you can see we got a lot of good stuff that we packed on for the past few episodes so some challenges even required me to get rid of everything and start fresh with just a gun a melee weapon and some gear uh, so we're gonna work on that in the next episode most likely or in the next few episodes but today I decided to take the few that these two challenges we're gonna be using actually and those two challenges are kill any walkers that I see so that means any walkers in my vicinity that are a threat to me I will have to kill right away I cannot just let them walk away so that's gonna be very interesting we're gonna see how that plays out in today's episode and the other uh, challenge is going to be we're not allowed to use any kits we cannot use the shops and we cannot use any player items and what that means is if I kill a player by any chance which doesn't look like it's gonna happen because there's not a lot of people on right now it's kind of early but if if it does come to an, uh, a moment where I have to kill a player on here I cannot use their items so that's gonna be interesting and see how that plays out other than that, if you guys are excited for these challenge videos on the Crafting Dead, make sure you guys all hit that like button. Let's see if we can go for, let's see, 100 likes to 200 likes. That would be awesome if you guys can do that. Let's get that hype in the chat. And again, if you guys want to participate in the challenge recommendations, make sure you type hashtag challenge. Uh, but let's get started, guys. Uh, as you can see, there are already two walkers right off. So we got to take them out as we do. Uh, bam, there we go. That was not too bad at all. Oh, there's a few more here that are a threat to us. Uh, I could say this guy's a threat to us. We can take him out. Um, and we can keep going about around here on this road, but I don't want to stay too much on this road because there are a lot of walkers. However, in the last episode, to our left, we did see an airfield, and that is the first thing I want to check out. Hopefully, we don't meet any danger around here. Oh, there's a walker. We got to kill as many walkers as we can. Let's see how many walkers we do have already in the bag. Uh, 51 zombies killed, so that's not bad. We're going to keep a toll on that and see how that works out for us. But so far, I want to check out this airfield. I've never seen it before and never actually explored it, so it should be pretty cool. Uh, so let's get into it. Let's see if this is going to work out. And by the ways, I want to mention something. You guys have been all wondering about... Oh my goodness. All right, hold up, guys. Hold your horses. <laughs> Hold your popcorn, everything you can hold on to. This is a lot of walkers here, but we can take it. We can take them out. We got this. Bam. There we go. Those guys were a threat. I got to be honest. That was a lot. Oh, we need some water. Definitely going to grab ourselves some water here. And by the way, I also read in the comment sections that some guy mentioned, I think it was Liam his name. I don't know. I'll pop up your, your comment on the screen. Uh, you said to not call the gun an FN. The military people actually call it an FAL. So we're going to call it an FAL or an FNAL. Uh, so I think we're gonna stick with F, uh, no, an F-A-L. There, there we go. I got that right. Oh, does this guy have any armor? Oh, he does. Oh my gosh. And he has so much stuff in his backpack. He has Juggernaut suit. Oh, this is so tempting, guys. Oh, we can't do it, though. We cannot take his gear. That sucks. Oh, that was a lot of good stuff, too. I'm just, you know what? Can we just take a sneak peek? Let's just take a look and see what was in that backpack. Because it's so tempting, it's not even funny. All right, let's check it out, though. Uh, I believe we can snap it on there and see what he had. You know what? That's actually, no, it's not a big deal. Okay, we're going to take it back off. My bad. We're going to place it back in his stuff here. Going to place our backpack back on, and we're going to keep going. Uh, so there we go. Oh, there's more walkers around here. Hopefully, we can find some water and some more food. We're kind of low on that stuff. Uh, but I wanted to mention about the Crafting Dead Let's Play series, which is the survival single player. And as you guys know, I did start a season two a while back, and all of a sudden kind of went, 
just dead. It didn't, no uploads came from it. And you guys were all questioning what was happening with it. And I kind of got bored of it for a bit. And I realized that you guys really do enjoy it. And I actually come to realize that I actually really did enjoy it as well. So I think I'm going to be bringing back the survival let's play of The Crafting Dead. How cool does that sound, guys? Let me know in the comment sections. I'm really going to be working hard to bring back a lot of Crafting Dead on the channel because it's something you guys enjoy. And I realize I've been slacking on that for a bit. So I'm going to make sure that doesn't happen. And for Fear of the Crafting Dead, it's going to be slacking a bit longer. Uh, we're still going to work on that for sure. But I think it's really going to hit strong once summer comes around the corner. So I think that's when you guys will be seeing a lot more role plays on the channel. Uh, because right now, it's just a, it's just a really big, big time consumer. Uh, and plus I have school to focus on so it is an interesting uh, thing to do So we'll, we'll figure that out as time goes on, but let's check out any more areas around here uh, There's got to be something uh, let's see there's, there's just got to be some sources around here some type of loot some Oh, there we go Okay, what's this? Uh, not a hard hat not gonna use that. Oh an empty syringe. That's very important for us All right, there's a lot of walkers that we've been taking out already I think we started at 51 like I said last time. We're already at 65 walkers killed already. This is pretty good. Oh, what's this? This is a blueprint recipe book. All right, that's actually very useful for us. So we're going to we're going to throw that into our backpack here. Bam, there we go. Uh let's actually take a look at it quickly. I want to see what it's all about as that walker just sits on the edge there. Uh let's see if we open it up. Oh, perfect. So it has the recipes to building a base. And that's something that you guys have been wondering about as well. And I'll probably do a tutorial on that to show you guys how to build bases. Because, you know what? To be honest, I don't even know how to build a base yet either. So, it's going to be a learning process. Uh, all right, let's keep going around downtown here. Hopefully, there's some more supplies that we can snatch up. Um, all right, anything here? But yeah, don't be afraid to leave any challenges in the comment sections. I'm going to be trying to do as many of these as possible because I think you guys really do enjoy this. And it's something that's a bit different as well. So hopefully it intrigues you guys and gets you guys active and all that good stuff. Um, are there a lot of walk? Oh my gosh, there's a lot of walkers down there. And they didn't say anything that's like, I cannot use a weapon or like a gun. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of walkers here. There's, oh shoot. Okay, we got to take them out. There we go. Bam. That right there is some action-packed zombie killing. That's pretty good. That was pretty good. Not bad. Okay, we did cause some attraction here for zombies to check out the, the area. But you know what? I can't do anything about it. That gun is loud. And I don't have a silencer on it. So, yeah, that's an issue. Uh, let's check out this, this airplane. I haven't checked any of these before. There probably is some good supply. Oh, a grenade. Okay, another rope. I don't know what we can do with rope. We gotta figure that out. Oh wait, no, I believe rope is actually for the makeshift splints. It's one of the crafting recipes used. So uh, I'll have to do a tutorial on that as well because I still don't know how to use that. And what's interesting is, if you guys don't know, those tutorials are also for me like learning the mod pack a bit more because I still don't know all the new additions to it. I don't know how to craft some new recipes. So for me, it's a learning experience as well. And I hope you guys are enjoying that series as much as I am. Uh, let's see, so a dirty rag, we have to clean that up, but a frag, that's going to be really important for us, so that's something we can look forward to using if we are in a dangerous uh, situation, so hopefully that doesn't happen though. Uh, there are some more walkers, they are a threat to us, we have to take as much of them out as possible, and I think you guys enjoy when I take out a lot of walkers, I think you guys have a blast from it, so, alright, those guys, I wouldn't say are a threat, this guy's a threat though, yeah, we're taking you out. All right, let's keep looking. This is a pretty big airport, I must say so myself, and I really like it because uh, there's not too many people on right now, which is really helping us out for the surviving here. Is there any walkers in here? No? Okay. Any take a look around here? Probably nothing. I don't want to go to the top. It's probably going to take a while, so I just want to keep looking around, maybe check out some of these planes. Maybe they have some simple supplies. Who knows? Passengers on here dropping some stuff. There we go. Fireman's hat. I don't need that, though. Uh, anything in here? No. Okay. Wait, actually, was there stuff? No, there wasn't. Uh, I also want to mention another thing, guys, in the comment sections. Uh, actually, not in the comment sections, but a challenge for you guys is I want to create a design for us. So, as you can see, this is, like, my current design with, with the sheep here, the sheep mask, and the disguise, and tan leather, or tan armor, and vest. Now, I want to ask you guys, let's create a design for ourselves. That means I want to create a design that we're going to use for every single episode, and it's going to be that design that people kind of, it stands out. It's like, oh, that's Alexton's group. That's his design type thing. We can make a theme for ourselves. So I don't really know what to do with the theme yet. So if you guys want to uh, create your own uh, design and then send me a picture or a screenshot of that design to my Twitter 
or somehow message it to me, then I'd be more than happy to check it out and maybe even use that design. So go for that, guys. I'm challenging you guys to make a cool design and we'll see how it works out. Don't worry about backpacks. Uh, just focus on just a simple design that we can really focus on right now. Uh, but all right, I guess we can move on from the, the airport. There wasn't much going on, to be honest. I mean, I can give it one more good look, but really, in general, um, all these buildings are pretty much blocked off in a way, as you can see here. So we can't really get into all these buildings. Uh, we did go check that one down there, but you know what? Let's keep looking around. Let's go see what else is around town here and uh, see if we can find some more supplies. And the good thing is if I do find... Well, actually, it's not really a good thing, but if we do find a stranger around here... Um, then when we kill him, we can't take his supplies. And I'm kind of, if you can see, in a bit of a trouble right now. I need some, I need to get some water. I'm kind of running low on, uh, hydration. So we really need to find some supplies ASAP, guys. It's, it's an issue right now. So we have to find as much of this as possible. Um, and I also wanted to talk about how often I'd be uploading Crafting Dead. Um, and I'm thinking, oh, what's this? Oh, Payday Mask. That's pretty cool. Um, but I was thinking, you know, how often should I upload Crafting Dead? And the server series with challenges, I think I can upload it every other day and make it something that's very, very busy on the channel, like a Crafting Dead main fan, fan base, which is what you guys really are. So I really do appreciate it because it means a lot. I love Crafting Dead. Um, so that being said, you guys could see much, a lot more Crafting Dead in the next few days now, and it's going to be something that I think is going to continue, so it should be good. Ugh, milk? No, we don't need that. What else is around here? And then for the Crafting Dead Season 2 of the Let's Play, I think I'm going to be trying to upload that two times a week, and we'll see how that works out. And if you guys are hyped for that, let me know in the comment sections. I know I'm saying a lot, but hopefully this gets you guys excited again, because I feel like my content kind of has been slacking a bit with not having as much Crafting Dead, and you guys kind of are getting bored of that because there wasn't much going on it was just kind of just random videos here and there and I feel like I let you guys down a bit so I'm gonna make it up to you guys with a lot of crafting dead and it should be a good time what is with all these empty cans I need some something to drink right now I need some hydration guys what is this uh oh this is coffee beans we did get a meat clever so I would say that works out for us. Um, all right. Well, let's keep looking around. Is there anything around here? No, no. All right. This kind of sucks. Um, I think this is the place where we were before. Is that walker still around here? Oh, he actually moved down a level. Okay. Uh, let's actually eat a pear. I think it's fresh. So, yeah, there we go. We can actually enjoy that because we don't get too much fresh food. Oh, you're outside. I don't need to take you out. Oh, what is this, guys? Hold on. Wait, is this new? Okay, this is the Charlie, guys. If you guys don't know, I did make a tutorial on this. So we have a Charlie crate. Let's check out what we get. We get ourselves some handcuffs. Oh, boy. So that's going to be interesting if we do get a prisoner, but we don't have any keys. So, yeah, we're going to have to break the news to him that we don't have any keys for that if we do find a prisoner. And that was also another challenge, which was to get some prisoners and see how that works out for us as well. So uh, that's pretty interesting. We're going to see how that works out in the future. But so far with the challenge, I think we're, we're acing it right now. We're destroying all these walkers. Is that a person down there? Oh, that's a person. That is a person, guys. Hold on, guys. Wait, we're gonna reload. We're gonna reload. Why is it not reloading? What is going on here, guys? There we go. Okay, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, no. Did he, did he leave? Did he just leave, guys? I think he just left. No, this can't be. We just had him in the bag, and the ammo just completely died on us. Where did he go? He, like, vanished, and there's a lot of walkers now. Is he inside? Is he inside? Is that the real trick question right now? I think he went inside the plane. I think he went inside the plane. All right, you know what we're going to do? We're going to throw a grenade. We're going to see if this helps us in, in any way right now. So let's see if I can throw this grenade. Do I see him? Oh, man, that sucks. We could have killed him. Uh, but I don't want to kill him, actually, maybe yet. Uh, let's grab this, this grenade, the frag. And throw it down somewhere around here in the middle and see if he's inside. I don't know if he is. But we're going to chuck this right about there. And bam, I think we took out a few. Okay, we did take out a few walkers. All right, well, you know what? We're going to let that guy live today because I guess it's his lucky day. I messed up with my ammo and my shooting skills. They they failed me, guys. I apologize. That never happens. And the reloading, I don't think I have any AKM. Do I not have any AKM? All right, this is a waste for us. Let's just re change this gun here. Reload this guy. Hopefully there's some ammo. We have seven, but I'm pretty sure 
I did have, yeah, I did have some, okay, this is weird. Well, you know what? That guy gets to live today. He gets to see another day. <laughs> All right, let's get out of this airport because it is kind of jam-packed, and I don't want to get into any more trouble here with some people. So let's make ourselves a journey down this street and not go into the airport because we did make a turnaround. However, we're coming close to the end of the episode, which is not a bad case because we're going to get to explore more on what's on this street in the next episode. Uh, let me know if you guys think I a plus or aced this challenge today in today's episode i think i did fairly well to be honest um i killed all the walkers i saw on my perimeter for the most part and i didn't get to steal any loot from someone if i killed him is he there oh <gasps> there he is guys there he is we got him oh what an ending but we can't take his supplies oh no let's see if he had any good supplies um oh no he really didn't have anything except for a blueprint which we have so there we go, guys. We killed Batman. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, let's actually uh, destroy his body so no one can get his supplies. There we go. All right, guys. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you guys hit that like button. As you can see, I think we definitely just now put an A-plus on today's challenge. Or today's challenges, let's say. Uh, because, you know what? We did everything the way it was supposed to be. We killed as many walkers. And let's see how many we killed. We went from 51, I believe, to 87 walkers killed. That's a lot. That's a big jump right there. I gotta say so myself. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Make sure you guys hit that like button down below in the comment sections. Let me know what you guys think about today's episode. Also, list some new challenges. Um, and I will make sure to try some of them out. And uh, other than that, let me know what you guys think about the survival season 2 of the Crafting Dead Return. And, uh, yeah, just in general, what do you think about more Crafting Dead? Peace out, guys. My name is Alex, and stay foxy.